What is up everyone, this is Justin from AppSlice, and in this video I'm going to be continuing my Hackintosh series by unboxing the Gigabyte uh, Z68MX UD2HB3 motherboard. So uh, let's just get started with it. I've heard a lot of good things about Gigabyte um, and their motherboards. Almost every Hackintosh build I've seen has a Gigabyte motherboard. Uh, and I have noticed the thing I really don't like about Gigabyte, just, just a little bit of complaint, is how crappy the design of their products are. I mean, like, look how... I can't even describe it. You ever been to one of those websites where they just have all these, like, really colorful clip art looking uh, graphics on? Well, this is kind of what it reminds me of. And I've seen the boot uh, splash, or the uh, bio splash screens, and I don't know. They don't look too pretty to me. But whatever. I mean, it doesn't really matter. It just more matters what uh, the performance of it is. This comes with a three-year warranty, uh, and it has a bunch of other crap on the front, which I'll get to anyway. Um, so we'll open it up, and inside we have got, oh, okay, we've got a warning saying that you can only use uh, socket 1155 CPUs and not socket 1156. 1156 was the previous generation um, core processors, and uh, socket 1155 is a newer generation core processors, also known as Sandy Bridge. Anyway, that's just uh, something. I thought this was like a sticker or something. Anyway. Uh, next is this little sticker for Dolby Home Theater. I guess that's the sound that comes on board. You can stick it on your computer if you feel like doing that. I'm not going to be. Uh, and then we've also got the user's manual, which, you know, you might want to take a look at. And we've got a driver install disk. There's also a multilingual installation, wow, installation guidebook. Okay, so we've got two, now, SATA. I used to say SATA, but I've been corrected, it's SATA. Um, <laughs> data cables. We've also got this, not too sure what it is. <laughs> We've got our I.O. panel. And, certainly not least, we have got the motherboard itself, as you can see there. So, uh, yeah. There's the I.O. We've got some. Uh, we've got a bunch of USB ports in the back, which is nice to see. Um, there is also eSATA. There's also uh, onboard HD graphics, including um, HDMI. There's also optical audio out. And we have got DVI, VGA, and uh, a bunch of analog audio and all that kind of stuff. There's also um, there's a USB 2 and USB 3, which is nice to see. Anyway, I'm going to get this installed on the computer and I'll let you know how everything goes as these videos progress. See you in the next video.